<laughs> okay, just the way that the robot moves, like, I don't know how to describe it. I would say if you were a human being inside there, though, this would be very painful. <laughs> What's going on everybody? Welcome back to Third Place Gaming. My name is Brad and today we are going to be checking out Fantasy Star Online 2. Now I know this game is a really big deal. A lot of people were super excited when it was announced that it was coming over to America and just people are super pumped for this game. It is currently free to play on Steam and so I figured I would check it out. That being said, I never played the first Fantasy Star so I really have no idea what I'm getting into. So this should be an interesting experience. So let's go. Alright, so we're going to be a male. Looks like there's a couple different caster. Looks like there's a couple different classes here. So we got human male, human female. Looks like Newman's cast. Oh, they look like robots. And the Dooman. I want to be a big robot. All right, here we go. So we have hunter, ranger, force, braver, bouncer, and summoner. I really have no idea what any of these classes are. I think we're going with the summoner. The idea of getting a pet is cool, and he just looks hilarious being a, a big robot holding a tiny green stick. So, let's go with summoner. Alright, so these must be... Oh, they're the base. Alright, so I'm not a big fan of this one. I don't like that you can... I don't know. I mean, that one looks kind of... That one's really short. Yeah, I like this one. I'm feeling this one. Alright, let's see what we can do. I want to see how in depth this really is. Looks like it's fairly <laughs> in depth. Master Chief looking dude. Alright, let's go with that one. Okay. Actually, let's make it interesting. Master Chief, it is. Can't do skin color. Wonder why. Alright, um, how do I, oh, back. Customize body, we're just gonna do random on everything, cause why not? Oh, it won't let me. Let's have a big boy. <laughs> okay, just the way that the robot moves, like, I don't know how to describe it. I would say if you were a human being inside there though, this would be very painful. <laughs> Can we do, well he's gotta be super tall. It's gonna be top heavy. Can we make them? I'm gonna have little legs. Little legs. Little legs. Thin bottom. No, that's that's just a thick robot. <laughs> right, let's just go. Ooh. And that's what, oh, that's boring. One more. Okay, that'll work. Right, we're gonna do it five times. So one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Nice. So I will definitely say there is a lot of character customization here. One, two, three, four, five. 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 There. I didn't want it to just be black. That's boring. Ooh. One, two, three, four, five. A monocle. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. Are they all just going to be glasses? Alright, so one, two, three, four. Five glasses. One, two, three, four, five. More glasses. One, two, three, four, five. Big ears that are just kind of sticking out the side of my robot. One, two, three, four, five. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Movement type. I want to hover. All right, let's do third. If I could type, 
place. Alright, why not? You know, now that I remember that I'm a caster, the glasses kind of make sense. Or not, a, yeah, I'm a caster. Summoner? I'm a summoner. Alright, so again, I've never played this game. The hype for this game is insane. People were freaking out as soon as it was announced. So, we're just gonna go ahead and jump into it. Alright. For some reason, I'm a bit nervous. Hello, pool. Okay, I fell in the water. I'm gonna be honest, I don't like the hover animation now that I've looked at it. I kind of miss walking. <laughs> Tutorial, I'm assuming. Hilda, Hello, Hilda. I will begin your certification. <laughs> First, I'm a fancy I'm lad. <laughs> Take a look around you. Those blocks in front of you, jump over them. I got this. I did it, you guys. Are you Good. proud of me? Okay. Someone now should I'll be. Confirm how you attack. All right. Teleporting a virtual target. Use your equipped hold weapon up, hold to up. attack it. My little doggy thing's name is Wanda. All right, normal attack. Let's kick some ass. Am I like conducting a symphony? Do 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 do. You get him, Wanda. Am I doing the right thing? Not like existentially, but like tutorial wise. Good. Now don't I guess so. Alright, the feeling of confusion. You got it. Okay. I'm a super dope robot. Ooh, what are these? Is that a Sylvans? Sure seems like a handful, but you can't look at something's butt and say it's a handful. That's offensive. This is 2020, my guy. Right, is there a way to lock on? Oh, lock on tab. Okay, cool. Feel the might of my orchestral power. So wait, can I hit? I can't hit from way back here. Multiple enemies have appeared. Don't forget to dodge Yeah, there's no range attacks. on that. But apparently, I can play him sweet, sweet music. And I can dance. I'm wondering if this wasn't the right choice for a starting class. More thick monkeys. Oh no. I'm really wondering if I should have went with the other class. I don't know, it just doesn't feel like I'm doing anything. Unless I'm supposed to feel like I'm not doing something, I don't. So I really think with this particular class, the whole whole goal, can't, the whole goal, God, there we go, is to kind of let the pet do all the fighting. But I'm not sure. I mean, I will be honest, that's not really a reflection of rock bear. It's not really a reflection on the game. I mean, the game's actually pretty... I've only been playing for a few minutes, to be completely honest. But, as a huge fan of, like, MMOs, I get it. Like, it makes sense. I get why this is fun. Oh, sweet. I can float and attack? Like, it's unique enough to make you want to come back. It's not just like, a, oh, hey... Here's another World of Warcraft clone. It's it's something different. Floating powers. Can't touch me, Rock Bear. I'm in the air. Didn't mean for that to rhyme. You know it's a really good way to destroy Rock Bears? Hitting that like and subscribe button. Alright, here we go. What did I get? I got 30 XP and then 30 gold diamond things. Yeah. Dude. Do, 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 do. Does your current weapon do, do. suit you? you Not really. Try various kinds of weapons until you find one you like. Ooh, what else? Ooh, what's this? Ooh, it's a sword. Okay. Oh, I like that a lot better. But does it get rid of my puppy though?
Okay, so if I want to use my summoning ability, I need to have the wand. If I go with the sword, or I can punch him. If I go with the sword, then I lose my summoning power. But it's a gun blade. We're going to go with the gun blade. See, I probably should have gone with a different class, because this feels... This is more fun to me. So yeah, I, I think I definitely... And again, that was my bad, not the game's fault. I just was a doofus and chose poorly. Okay, so the melee in this game, and like the combos and stuff, is legit. Like... I know games like Terra and stuff try and do like the action combat, and some of them it just doesn't feel natural or smooth. This game it feels pretty smooth, like it just it feels All good right. to do. The collection point is just ahead. We have to endure a bit longer. Let's do it. I completely missed. Okay. There we go. What is this thing? I'm gonna hit him. Ooh, jump attack. Didn't mean to turn on my caps lock. Where's my health at? I should probably pay attention. Um, uh, I'm gonna top off. Whoa, what's that? Oh my god. I don't think I actually got to heal. I think that thing got to me before I could heal. Alright, so yeah. Um, I'm just going to go out and say it. Pro strat right here. He pooped on me. That's not the pro strat. Pro strat. If you are new to this game, I strongly recommend going with like a melee class to get the most out of it because it is a completely different experience based off of what I was doing a few seconds ago versus this one. Oh, open field, you know what that means. Yo. I mean, I knew it was going to be a boss. I didn't know it was going to be like this thing. Stop with the dang cap locks, bruh. Alright, what is it locking on to? Oh, no. Oh, no. Maybe locking on isn't always the best. I okay, I feel like I have. Alright, I feel like. There we go. Here we go. Okay, that's what I'm doing, bruh. No, I'm not. Oh my god. My stupid sausage fingers keep hitting the cap lock. The targeting isn't the greatest. It's very easy to kind of... Oh, my bad. Oh, I'm stunned. I'm stunned. Run away. Run away. No, I'm locked on, so I'm only running in a circle. Okay, let's, uh... Let's heal up. No. It's coming for me. What are those? No, leg. 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 I don't like how I can't really choose where it targets. I just have to kind of rotate through it. Wait, am I supposed to be going for the body? Yeah. I guess we'll go up to this target. Oh, it's his face. Oh, I didn't kill him. I just... Wait, did I kill him? I didn't kill him. Someone killed him. Sweet. Alright, so I will say I'm definitely feeling it now, Mr. Krabs. This is... I get it. I get the hype behind this game. Welcome back, everyone. I'm glad you made it back in one piece.
I'm going to keep playing, but we're going to kind of go over the review a little bit and kind of discuss some of the aspects of the game, see if it's worth your time or not. So this game, Fantasy Star Online 2, is not a new game. It's new to us in the States and in North America, but to Japan, this game's been out since like 2012. And the game looks like it's been out since 2012, but I don't want to hold that against it. I mean, let's be honest, it still plays good. It still looks good. So that's not going to hurt it in the long run. It looks like it's a primarily... Uh, what i'm looking for like instance based where you oh definitely some lag on the ship i can't move okay we'll go ahead we'll do this one and then we'll probably wrap it up here because i don't the whole point of me doing these is just to kind of roughly scratch the surface to see off based off the first like 45 minutes to an hour of gameplay it's something that's going to interest you, so... Dang. I don't know why, but my dude reminds me of, like, a Gundam. Maybe it's because I made him look like a Gundam. Yep. Alright, so... I don't know, again, and it's kind of hard to speak to all the missions, but this one, it looks like it's go around, defeat the enemies, gather the information, and continue on. So... Very standard instance type quests. Nothing crazy, nothing too weird or out of the ordinary. And I'm about to die. And so combat is fairly straightforward. Holy crap, those things hit really hard. I don't think I was ready for this mission. Um, definitely quite a few class classes to choose from and races. I didn't really go into them, but a few of them look like your basic caster. One was literally called caster. Uh, your melee classes, your range classes. Looks like it had the standard holy trinity of combat for these type of games. I really appreciate how despite choosing the summoner role, I'm not limited to just that, like, I've been using a gun blade basically the entire time once they told me about it, because I just prefer that and probably would have been happier off with another class. So I would strongly suggest if you have a solid internet connection, if you're looking for a- ooh, I have AoEs. If you're looking for a solid free-to-play game, and again, I know this game has a cash shop. Uh, I've not seen it, but I've definitely heard about it. And so, I mean, again, it's a free-to-play game, so it shouldn't surprise you that there's a cash shot. I would also say, don't let that stop you. This game is a lot of fun. It's free. I get why people have been waiting for it, and so you don't really have much else to lose. You have nothing to lose. It also took, like, three hours to download. So, you know, start it up before you go to bed or on, as you're walking out the door for work. And boom, you got a game when you get home. So, all right, so I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna keep playing for a little bit, but I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up this video so I don't have to keep talking to you guys and trying horribly to entertain somebody. So yeah, uh, do not forget to go ahead and smash that like and subscribe button for me. I'd really appreciate it. You know, tell your friends about the channel and get them to subscribe. But yeah, peace.